Australia series of exam readiness videos for the Mathematical Methods course. Congratulations on finding your way to this resource, which has been developed specifically for students as you revise for the Maths Methods exams. Our expert team of Maths Methods teachers has carefully selected key concepts and technology applications for demonstration in this set of over 25 short recordings. We know that your capacity to quickly and efficiently utilise your TI Inspire CAS will be a key factor in exam success, both in the lead up to exams and also on the big day. With this in mind, we have made these support videos in sets that best reflect the course outline and specified outcomes. Set 1 covers topics from algebra. Set 2, topics from the study area of functions and graphs. Set 3, calculus. Set 4, probability. And we've also included a fifth set on calculator setup tips and shortcuts. Now accompanying many of the videos, there are also sample TNS or TI Inspire files that you can download and use on your calculator. Keep watching this video now if you would like to see a quick refresher on how to do this. Otherwise, proceed directly into viewing the support videos of your choice. This is the video from the first set on algebra and the video covers the topic of factor and remainder theorem. You can see that accompanying this video, there is an invitation for you to download a set of practice questions in the form of a TNS file. If you could simply click the down download tab, you can save that into the download sections of your computer or to another nominated place on your computer. I've just done that. Now to view the TNS file or and transfer it to my calculator, I require a piece of software called the TI Computer Link. To find that, from the Texas Instruments Australia website, education.ti.com stroke en dash au, if I look under products, computer software, you can see that the TI Inspire Computer Link software is one of the options. Select that. I'm now at the page where I can download this software. I click download and it also downloads to my computer, whether it be Windows or Macintosh. I've done this earlier and you can see the icon on my taskbar at the bottom of my screen here. Once the software is downloaded and installed on your computer, in free software, I open it up and you can see two parts to the screen here. The upper part is showing the file management for my computer. I have already highlighted the downloads section and you can see the factor and remainder question TNS file that we downloaded from the website. The bottom part is where we see the file management for your calculator. Watch what happens now when I plug my calculator in. I'm going to press refresh here and the computer software has now searched for and found my calculator. This is the unique product ID code for my calculator. When I press select, the software now looks at the file system on my calculator. To transfer the factor and, relate and remainder questions TNS file, I simply drag and drop 